Okay, I picked up the excellent Elite Spanker Tactical Organizer. And it had mixed reviews. Some were good, some were bad. It says that it's um, 5 inches by 1 inch by 7 inches is what it says. So this is supposed to be approximately 7 inches. It looks like, yeah, it looks like it's 7 inches there. And this is supposed to be, from what it says, 5 inches. And I don't think it's 5 inches wide. It's looking like it's just shy. It's looking like 4.5 to me. And then thickness-wise, it's supposed to be an inch. And actually, mine's about 2 inches. So this thing is not dead on from what they're saying on Amazon, that's for sure. It is a small package. It does have a piece of Velcro on the front, which is kind of nice. Comes with two zippers, comes with the poles. This is a Molly hookup, so you can hook it to a pack or you can run a belt through here and carry it on your waist, which is really nice. Now, what I've done is I'm still setting this up for an everyday carry, so. And it was funny when I started setting this up, it was um, because it's so cold outside, I, I ended up putting everything and everything that you could imagine that was for fire in here. It was, it was ridiculous. I was turning it into a fire kit. And I'm going, why am I doing that? But I've got just in the front pocket here, which is very thin, not very thick, just a bunch of pens, mechanical pencils. Um, things that I need there. That's all I got in there. Now, the zipper, as I come around, okay, see if I can open this up for you. I got a right in the rain pad. Um, this is for cleaning your glasses or your camera equipment. And I've got my Swiss Army knife in here. And so far, that's all I've got in there, in the big pocket. Now, if I go to the back, back here, I've got a flashlight, which is over here. Okay. This is what I got there. A little pin light, basically. And I don't know who makes it, don't care. Um, this is for... Lenses cleaning off your lens and inside here. I got lens cleaner, which It allows you to spray Onto your lens actually So you can clean it up good. This is a Victorial Knox sharpener Is what this is So it helps me sharpen my Swiss Army knife and I've got a letter in here of the zombies, Walking Dead. So, I don't have a whole lot in here yet. I'm still playing with it. I've added some stuff. I've taken stuff out. And when you start building an everyday carry, it's kind of different. It's like, am I going to start fires with an everyday carry? And no, I'm not going to do that. And if you're actually booking at home in case of SHTF, should you have a fire kit in there? I mean, I'm slowly debating and because my get home bag has a fire kit and everything in it. So it's just being redundant if I'm doing that. It's more or less thinking about what do I need to add in here of things that I would use on a constant basis every day. And if I'm in the city, I'm not going to be starting a fire you know <laughs> off to the side now the pens and pencils and everything in there and the right and rain pad that is something i would use quite a bit and why have so many pens why have so many pencils and a black magic marker well simple to be quite honest with you i mean a lot of times you go to use a pen and it don't work it's too cold it's too damp who knows grab another pen and okay that one works you just never know what's going to happen or grab the black magic marker pull up to the side see a phone number on a house or you know, something like that, and you want more information, you want to have something to quickly write it down on. So the, the right in the pad and 
the pens and pencils definitely make sense. A lot of times I have my little camera with me, so cleaning the front of it, it makes perfect sense is what it does. Now, originally, I need to put these in too, and these are camera specific camera wipes, which wipes the front, which I need to add to this yet. But um, I'm still playing with the everyday carry. Probably be at it for, I don't know, probably a good couple of weeks, maybe even a month. But the pouch itself is made by Excellent Elite Spanker. And I like multicam, so, and they make it multicam, so that kind of gave some of my choice. A lot of people I've seen in the reviews said, oh, the stitching wasn't that good. Um, I never found any problems at all. So unless I got lucky, I, I don't know. Like, you got a morale patch here, too. You can put on for yourself. I threw this one on for the time being. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it. I might try something else. But overall, I like the pouch. The pouch is really well made. You know. It, it seems like a lot of companies, though, they add a lot of stuff on these pouches that don't need to be added. Like, you take this strapping here on the front they added. I mean... That's to attach it to something, I guess. But at the same time, it does make the pouch a little bit more sturdier. But that really was not needed. That's just extra weight they've done. That's the thing. And I was automatically thinking with this pouch was, I seen this little thing in the front, and I was like, oh, yeah, I could put my pens, my pencils, everything I need right there, and they'll be right there, and I don't have to open the pouch. Another thing to consider with pouches is, what are things I'm going to grab constantly? So am I going to grab a pen? Am I going to grab... I should put a little piece of paper in here. Maybe right in here. Maybe I need to do that. So when I grab it, I can grab that and then pull it out. So this is a work in process. This is going to be my everyday carry. It's just small enough where it'll fit on my belt. And I do like this because any size belt that'll fit on, just slide the belt through it. It ain't going nowhere. It's pretty, it's sturdy. So I really like that. But this excellent Elite Spanker Tactical Pouch, these funny names they give things, eh? Tactical. Um, I think this is, and they come in all different colors, blacks, browns, whatever. It depends whatever you like. And a good reason I picked up Multicam, because I'm not sure if I'm going to use it on my pack. I'm not sure if I'm just going to leave it on my waist. Maybe if I just use it on my waist, maybe I'll pick up another one. I'll have a link in the bottom to this pouch. But it's a good size. You know, you can get quite a bit in here. And uh, that's that's what matters, you know. So I'm not sure what else I'm going to put it. What else would you put in? I mean, you think about it. Most of the time I'm in the city, um, driving around. It's not like I'm out in the bush. So what are some things you would add to it that you think I should have in an everyday carry? I'm still playing around with it in my head. Would you add a fair rod just in case? I mean, or are you going to end up just carrying that around for nothing? Let me know in the comments, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.